experts agree that endothermal ablation, such as endovenous laser, is the best treatment for varicose veins. However, it may surprise you to know that if we only treated your varicose veins by laser, they probably wouldn't go away. Yes, that's right. Endovenous laser by itself is not enough. Now, last week, one lady from the USA contacted us at the Vein Care Centre to ask for advice. She had had endovenous laser by her specialist in the US. He had performed endovenous laser successfully, but her varicose veins did not change. She contacted us here in the United Kingdom to ask why. Well, superficial venous reflux, the downflow of blood in the incorrect direction, is the cause of varicose veins. First thing in the morning when we get out of bed and stand up, gravity tends to pull the blood down the veins in the wrong direction. If the valves in the veins are not working, reflux occurs, filling visible side branches under the skin. Even when the reflux is abolished, these side branches will not disappear. Because over time, as a result of superficial venous reflux, they have been stretched beyond their elastic recoil. Even after successful laser treatment, they will remain baggy and visible. That's why an adjunctive procedure such as phlebectomy or foam sclerotherapy is required. Laser can't be used to treat these very superficial varicose veins under the skin directly for two reasons. Firstly, they are tortuous, that is, they're twisty and turny and have kinks in them, and a, strained, and a straight laser fibre can't be inserted along them and used to treat them with heat energy. Secondly, because of the laser energy and the temperatures reached, the skin nearby might get injured if laser was used to treat these varicose veins directly. So that's why an adjunctive procedure is used in addition to laser to get the best results for varicose veins.